Welcome to InfiGyan friends. Today in this video we are having one very interesting and challenging exponential problem. It is x power log x base 4 whole cube equal to x power 4 over 64. We have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started by writing two powerful properties of log. So property number one it is log a power b with base c can be written as b log a with base c and second property is the division part. I will write log a over b if base is c then we can write this equal to log a with base c minus log b with base c. Now I will use both the properties while solving. Now I will write our given equation. So log x base 4 whole cube it is equal to x power 4 divided by 64. Now I will consider log both sides. So I will write here log with base 4. Why it is with base 4? Because of in our equation it is already given. Clue is there with base 4. Once we will consider base 4 calculation will be minimum. Now you can see I will use property number 1 in LHS. How it is? This exponent, this exponent will come as a multiplier and right hand side division property will be applicable. So let's apply. I will write LHS as log x base 4 whole cube in one bracket and then log x base 4 right hand side. I will write log base 4 x power 4 minus log base 4 64. Now left hand side if you will see it is same thing log x base 4 log x base 4. So it is power 4. So let me write log x base 4 whole power 4 equal to. I will take this 4 as a multiplier. So it will become 4 log x base 4. And this value this 64 can be written as 4 cube. Now 3 will come as a multiplier. So it will become 3 log 4 basis 4. Now in next step we will write log 4 base 4 will be 1. This value will be 1. So ultimately equation is converting into simple one. Log x base 4 whole power 4 equal to 4 log x base 4 and minus 3. Now straight away picture is we have to use substitution. So we will use log x base 4 equal to suppose y it is. So let us consider log x base 4 equal to y. So this equation will become y power 4 equal to 4y minus 3. Take all the term to one side y power 4 minus 4y plus 3 equal to 0. This is one quartic equation. We have to solve this quartic equation but this time we won't use SDM and rational root theorem. We will solve this question using factorization only. So let us begin and remember what was our substitution log x base 4 is y. So we will put that value at last. So I will solve this quartic equation using factorization. So I will begin with this 3. I will write this equation minus 1 and 3 is there. So I will write plus 4 minus 4y equal to 0. So I can write y power 4 minus 1 and then I will take 4 common if I will take then it will become 1 minus y equal to 0. Now you can see this is y square whole square minus 1 whole square and I will write minus 4 in bracket then y minus 1 equal to 0. Now a square minus b square formula 
it will give us a plus b times a minus b. Let's apply. So I will write y square plus 1 times y square minus 1 minus 4y minus 1 equal to 0. Again, we will use difference of two squares. So we can write y square plus 1, y plus 1, y minus 1, minus 4y minus 1 equal to 0. Now we will take y minus 1 common. So what will be left in the bracket? y square plus 1 times y plus 1 and then minus 4. So let us take y minus 1 common. So I will write y minus 1 common in bracket y square plus 1 times y plus 1 and minus 4. Right hand side is 0. Now expand. Take the product. So I will write here y cube plus y square plus y 1 minus 4. So let me write here minus 3 directly equal to 0. So now quartic converted into two factors linear and power 3 degree 3. Now we will use again factorization for this cubic equation. So I will split this time minus 3 as minus 1 minus 2. So I will write y cube minus 1 and then I will write y square plus y minus 2. Now a cube minus b cube. So I will write a minus b, a square plus a b plus b square. And then we are having y square plus y minus 2. So I can write this one as y square and then I will be writing 2y minus y as y minus 2 as it is. Now this will be y minus 1, y square plus y plus 1 plus y is common from first two. So I will write y plus 2 and then I will take minus 1 common then y plus 2. So ultimately here I can write it is y minus 1, y plus 2 equal to 0. This term is y minus 1 times y square plus y plus 1 plus. Now you can see y minus 1 is again common. So y minus 1 is also there and y minus 1 is about to come. So I will write here y minus 1 whole square and in bracket it would be this term plus y plus 2. So I will write y square plus y plus 1 plus y plus 2 equal to 0. So this is one quadratic y square plus 2y plus 3 equal to 0. Now I will write. Now you can see f dot g equal to 0. So f equal to 0 or g equal to 0. So let us put this value y minus 1 whole square will be 0 or second equation was y square plus 2y plus 3 equal to 0. So two equations we will find out our solution for y. So from first one I will be writing y minus 1 equal to 0 or y equal to 1 with multiplicity 2. Now come to the quadratic equation y square plus 2y plus 3 equal to 0. Let's find out discriminant or let's find out root straight away. Minus b plus minus under the root b square minus 4ac. So 12 divided by 2a. Complex root is about to come. Minus 2 plus minus this is i times square root 8. So 2 root 2 divided by 2. So last step would be minus 1 plus minus i times root 2. And this solution we will reject as it is complex value. So rejected. Complex solutions. Now which solution we will accept that is y equal to 1. Now remember what was our substitution 
y. So I will put this value log x base 4. This was y. And right hand side is 1. So I will consider the exponent form. So I can write x is equal to 4 power 1 or x is equal to 4 is the only real solution. Now let's verify this answer. Now I will write, let me write here verification x equal to 4. So I will write 4 power log 4 base 4 whole cube equal to 4 power 4 divided by 64. Now you can see log 4 base 4. This value will be 1 cube. And right hand side 4 power 4 denominator is 4 cube. So using exponent law of division it will be 4 power 4 minus 3 which will be 4 power 1 equal to 4. RHS is 4. LHS is also 4 power 1. So 4 equal to 4. That means this is verified solution. I hope you like this video friends. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.